We know that when Jesus founded the church and sent his disciples out, he wasn't envisioning that the church would be made up of spectators. He really wants us to come to know him in a very personal way and then to invest ourselves in, in living the gospel, but also in, in sharing it with, with our brothers and sisters. There are a lot of aspects to life in, in this archdiocese. We want them all to flourish. And through the annual appeal, we have the chance not only to receive of blessings from the Lord, we also have the chance to share, to reach out to those who, who are in need, to provide education and formation for young people in, in, in our parishes. I'm struck by the number of people who are willing to make sacrifices to invest in the vitality of their parishes in the schools of which we are always so proud. So many blessings flow to people all across our archdiocese because of your generosity. It's that spirit of sacrifice that helps us identify more closely with Jesus. I ask all of you, my brothers and sisters in Christ, to receive from me a request to participate in this year's Archbishop's Annual Appeal. Please pray for the success of, of, of the appeal. Pray for me and for our brothers and sisters in the faith that we might understand how to, to move forward on, on the, this journey of faith that we have, have undertaken. What we receive and support from, from the Annual Appeal is really essential in our achieving the goal that we've set and really making this journey of faith an experience of, of the living church uh, for us and for our people.